All right, we got wheels and tires already mounted and balanced, ready to go for the Jeep from Custom Offsets. Thank you, Custom Offsets, man. FedEx just dropped off the wheels and tires. Man, I, I gotta say, like, I've consistently had good experiences with FedEx here. Not to say that I've had bad experience with UPS because like the UPS driver that comes to my house, him and I know each other by name. He fucking, he's, he helped me push the Camaro. Dude, like, I've had a lot of good experiences with, with FedEx and UPS here, so. Anyway, they dropped off the wheels and tires for the Jeep Gladiator. These are about to go on uh, the, the Gladiator, the truck. You guys forgot that I had that shit. You got the uh, lift dashboard for the old Camaro. Let me get that out. We have the lift here, which I think this has everything I need. It's a four and a half inch, uh, or four inch or something like that. Let's see, and the instructions, a ready lift. Okay, yeah, it's a ready lift four inch suspension for the Gladiator. I think it's got everything besides a sway bar. I don't have the sway bar yet. Also got the lift from my boys over at Custom Offsets. They've been like super awesome to have a part of the channel and they have a discount code you guys can use for for all the shit that on their, like they have tons of stuff on their website you can use. But I'm gonna load up the wheels and tires in the back of the truck, go drop these off at uh, my buddy's shop. Uh, my buddy Drew, you guys remember him, Off-Road Mafia. And we're gonna talk about lifting the Gladiator and doing a couple other shits. Spoiler for my for the Mustang. I actually, got a shit ass Mustang wing. <laughs> How am I supposed to pick these things up? They're so big. They're like literally taller than I am. I'm only gonna bring four with me as well because the fifth one is a spare. If you guys don't know, this build is for 74 Auto. They gave me the Gladiator to build and then we're gonna sell it. But I told Alan, I was like, listen, I'm not gonna do this half-ass. I need to do this right. I need the right budget for it. I'm not going half-ass. We went 38 inch tires. We went four inch lift. You know, I'm gonna build a whole bunch of cool stuff for it, but I'm only gonna bring four of the wheels because uh, there's no reason for me to bring the full size spare. Thirty-eight degrees out and raining. They're actually not that heavy. They're just slippery. Got some spike lug boys. Something. Valve stems. They're so wet and slippery. What do I do? Remember, when lifting, always use your lower back. Lock your legs. Hold your breath. Don't breathe. You want maximum tension on your lower back. Now I'm gonna get the last wheel in to show you what they look like. Uh, well, actually, I'm going to put the, the lift in. All right. Oh, yeah. Put mud tires. Do whatever you want. Oh, wow. Those things look so cool. So gnarly. Nice. Look at these bad motherfuckers. Dude, I like these so much. Holy shit. I might need to do something like this for the dually or for the ram. The Rhino Shredders? I think, I think that's what they're called. Dude, those are gonna look so good on the Gladiator. Yeah? Jackson, you got a bath yesterday and you smell so good. Yes, you do. But I gotta go. I love you. Look at him, he's sad that I gotta go again. I hate leaving you. You dog. <coughs> Shit, I left that there. Isn't it weird that I'm using like one truck to drive all my other truck stuff so I can drop it off and then do a lift? I don't really know what app this shit is. And, uh, motherfucking, um, springs and motherfucking, um, stickers and motherfucking instructions. Go! Go, go, go! Go, 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 go! So I want to say I appreciate everybody's patience for, like, with the dually and whatnot. Because I know that with the dually, it's not fucking happening as fast as you'd like. And that's fair. But the truth is, it's been really weird, like, just having to work on it here and there. And then, like, with SEMA, I lost almost a full month of working on it, which is... You know, which kind of sucks, but we'll tune in on this weekend. And uh, with Christmas and the holidays, towards the end of the year, I'm gonna learn from this lesson to never start projects at the end of the year. Because I started like four of them at the end of the year, and, and none of them are done. And the rain's really fucking loud. North Georgia Autism Center. This place is like right next to Justin's shop. Oh, suspension test. 
All right. I didn't want to like just like walk in and like expect it to like pull it in here because no, looks... you walk in wherever you want, man. Oh, okay. It's your house. That's my house. I'll see you back. <clears throat> I'm gonna go do some hood ration. Gonna lift that truck. Going. Wet as fuck. Oh man, good to what see you again. Up? I'll do the video thing. Good to see you again. What up, bro? Nice to meet you, man. I'm Dan. Haven't met you guys yet. Nice to meet you. Right, I'm Matt Charlie. Uh, we've already met before, haven't we? Not? Yeah, we met um, probably at the was it the event? Before SEMA. Yeah, right before SEMA at Justin Chapel. Yeah. Just a bunch of bullshit. Some bullshit. Lots of bullshit. Lots of bullshit. They're all wrapped in pretty plastic so they stay dry. Yeah, they were like like five tall because I got the full size spare, but I didn't bring the full size. There's no mount for it, so I was like, I'll just leave it. Is this is this uh, Brian's old cart? It was, yeah. now it's my, well, it's my kids. Now. It's your kids now? Yeah. Like, uh, like body, like re recoil? So it's a 76 CJ5 tub. Yeah. Oh, doing shit. doing a full restoration on a, on a 76. This is like all fresh looking metal. Painted white and clear coated. And so, then we're gonna lay it on chassis. And just like, it'll drop right on? I mean, hopefully. Yeah. Up underneath it, the 47. The little, we'll go underneath her. Dude, look, it's got the ammo cans. Are these loaded? <laughs> Dude, this thing is sweet. What do you think you fit an LS in it or what? Yeah. Look. Don't fuck shit up. I kind of wish you had broken it. I need to get a different. <laughs> Look, don't be fucking shit up. He's the one that's doing burnouts randomly in the middle of 41. Not true. You guys saw that too? <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Like, I'm surprised they didn't get mad at me for it. Like, no one's <laughs> contacted me yet. Do a random U turn and oh, I'm sideways. Open them up. They look like they're pretty. I opened up the spare. We might have already been on Instagram and seen them. Yeah, maybe. But I mean, like, I may have tagged you guys in them. You might have. Yeah. <laughs> I got the whole lift and stuff too. We can. I just want to go through the lift and make sure we got everything. I don't have the sway bar yet though. Is that gonna matter? Sway bar links. Or it doesn't matter. I mean, look at all this. Look at all this. This seems actually really simple compared to like what I thought it was gonna look like. You I mean, this? I love Dan. Uh -oh. so. Hey Drew, here's the instructions. It starts at page 15. Yeah. And we have page 16. There's and that's fucking it. Yo, it came with like three pages. I'm just missing the second page. All right, that's second all. Page. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Yo, that's how it came. It came with those pages. This is stuff for Laura. <laughs> is it really? <laughs> oh shit. Is that strap on that I ordered for? <laughs> like that's what I think these things look cool. I don't give a shit what anybody makes me feel about them. I got like I'd run them on my Camaro if I was more confident in myself. These are our parts, okay? So I'm gonna go over everything and you guys can correct me. So we got a bucket of bolts and spacers and whatnot. You got or, your uh, Or sway bar end links. Yeah, whatever. And really then you got your you know, these are your uh these are your frame arm extenders extenders. Or rear lower control arm. Sure, yeah. But we got two of them, just for reasons. Uh we got a full, full wheel caps, that's nice, some spiky lugs. Uh, you got your uh, you got your crown for the top of your tooth. You know I don't know I don't know bolts nuts. Okay I don't know what this one is. That's track bar. Tra what is it? Front track bar. Front track bar. Okay we don't we only need one of those. Is that the sway bar that I was supposed to order that I didn't order? The rear track bar you're supposed to order you didn't order that would be the one. Okay gotcha yeah gotcha. I, I think these are probably I don't know what these are. Valve stem covers like the whole thing. Like, like inside, what's? Oh wait, I know. I think these are supposed to be like aluminum, right? So that way, it's like you know, it's matching. Universal. Super cute. Mm -hmm. Accessorizing. Kind of disappointed. I would like them to be bedazzled. Bedazzled? <laughs> They're too small. <laughs> no such thing as too small bedazzled. <laughs> for the rear, right, or for the front? Cold springs well, for the front. In the rear? Are they leaf springs? They're cold springs in the back. Really? Yeah. Okay. Got the cold spring spacer. So that they just use the OEM, yeah, OEM springs, springs in the rear. Spacer. Okay, gotcha. Bolt stop extension for the rear. Ooh. Bolts down and allows you? it the bigger lift. Can we just weld these together and make yeah, a double stack? A yeah, that's yes. not how that works. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Yeah, JTJ. Oh, is that what this is? This is yeah, a sender. It keeps the sway bar. Stop. It just makes these longer to accommodate for the lift. Okay. Oh yeah, that makes that makes a whole lot of fucking sense actually. This is my first like. Jeep build. Jeep build, definitely. So, like, all new stuff for me. Those two for the front? Yeah. I'll take an egg sandwich. They got, they got, they got egg sandwiches? Yeah, AM delivery. Probably a little bit spoiled overnight over here. Right, that'll all be here, AM delivery. Oh, wow, that was super easy. I didn't even have to work. Like, you just called someone and were like, hey, we got your shit order. I didn't have to do anything. I was just like, I just showed up with the wrong stuff. And you're like, I got it. about 9.30 on the UPS truck. Is that what you want me to be here? I can do that. Yeah, you want what time you want to start? I got to leave at 10, so. So we got like a 930, we'll let Raymond get it up on the lift and you know, we can do the preliminary stuff. And yeah. when Charlie gets back, we'll go into full build. I won't be gone 45 minutes and it's right here. Oh dude, I mean, like I got all day. Well, I'm trying to get you out the door into the alignment shop. 
because I've already got your appointment tomorrow to get it. <gasps> oh my god, it's like Christmas. You guys are so <laughs> nice. Yeah, we got shop right here. They're Jeep nuts. They know Jeep nuts. <laughs> the big ones. The, big Jeep nuts. the 38s over there, those are Jeep nuts. I hardcore really wanted to do 40s because everyone's like, do 40s, you know? Like 40s, hell yeah. I don't Ooh. I don't think I want to do 40s. I oh, barely want to do these. This is big. Those will be fine on the truck. Think so? Yeah. And they'll track all right. And... Yeah, they'll be good. Let's see if I can pick it up. Do it. Uh, I just gotta get good grip on it. It's so tall. Squats, squats. You really wanna, when, it, when lifting, you really wanna like lock your back out. It's all in the back. It's all in the lower back. Look at those jeans. Those this jeans thing are is awesome. Here's a mop up the puddle up underneath you. you. Just get down below the front axle, squat down. All right, squat down. And then look straight up. Oh, <laughs> what do you hit like a rock or something? Holy shit. Had a lady drive into the <coughs> tire. Well, that's not build Ford tough. <laughs> oh, it popped so hard and sideways it, it ruptured the pan. Yeah. Damn, she blew her engine or she, or he? I don't know. I think it's okay. We don't know yet. All right, here we go. I'm gonna swing by Justin's on my way out, and then we'll be here first thing in the AM. Lift that tr the Jeep Gladiator. Hell yeah, I'm so excited. Dude, I'm so excited to get this Jeep finally lifted and whatnot because I've, I wouldn't want to drive it, but it's just been sitting in my house. And I don't want to drive it while it's, you know, still stock because it's like, you know, it's boring. <laughs> and oh yeah, the title, the title isn't clear. So I'll have to get up here tomorrow and hopefully not get arrested. So I'm really excited for the off-road mafia guys to want to help out and be a part of this. And then on top of, oh man, I took a wrong turn. Fuck. I'll be doing more off-road stuff with them when it comes to like lifting the, the, the other, when it comes to lifting this truck or when it comes to lifting the dually, if I ever decide to lift that dually or vice versa, uh, those are going to be the guys that I go to for all my shit. Like, some of the stuff that they make is just bananas. What is that? Is that Fulty's? Is that Fulty's Camaro? It is Fulty's Camaro. I just park like an asshole when I'm here. I don't care. Look at that. That's my buddy Fulty's Camaro. Uh, he, he, he pitches for the Braves. Oh, yeah. I'm also dropping off some stuff. Hey! For uh, Off-Road Mafia, dude. They're working on his Jeep here. Drew asked me to drop this stuff off. Now I'm on the way home. It's really shitty out. Like, awesome. This looks like what like Washington looks like all the time. But tomorrow I get to go lift the Gladiator. I'm super excited about that. We're gonna put that bitch on 38s. And Off-Road Mafia is gonna treat us real good. They're gonna, I'm gonna do my best to help. I'm gonna, like, I like helping. But at the same time, it's also kind of nice to not have to do my own shit right now because I've been doing a lot of my own shit right now. Actually, Laura and I are gonna take a snowboarding trip soon. And I might bring that thing. It'll be four wheel drive. Jeeps handle gray in the snow, right? That's like their main shit. That'd be perfect. I'll take that bad boy up there in the snow. It's four wheel drive, it'll be comfortable. Whatever video, I'm gonna end today's video now. And I'm trying a new thing, like where I'm making, I have to really yell now, cause the, the rain's really heavy, but I'm trying a new thing where I, uh, I tell people, uh, I'm trying a new thing, I'm just making different kinds of videos. So let me know what you think. If you like this video, leave a thumbs up. If not, oh fuck it. Ain't. You don't leave a thumbs down, I guess. Whatever. Love you. Appreciate you guys. This sucks. <laughs>